Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Today we have a special project that's perfect for a wedding gift. My neighbor's boss is getting married soon and she and her co-workers wanted to create something unique and useful for their boss's home. So they came up with the idea of having me make an electric stove top cover. I've never made one so this is a new project for me to try. So stay tuned and watch the video. Here I'm using my Festo track saw. This helps me get two parallel faces together. So when I glue the boards together, they come out flat and perfect. I'm just lightly clamping together the two boards to dry fit them before I apply glue. Once you apply the glue, there's no going back and it's better to check as I do here to make sure that there is no gap in the panels before I glue them up. Nice, even pressure, a thin line to squeeze out on top is the perfect way to glue boards together. You don't want to too tight of a panel because then it could cup or bow in the clamping. This is the first chance I get at determining how wide to cut two rails, one for each side. These two rails are going to be glued and nailed from the back of the panel to create the profile of each side. After 24 hours, the board is now ready to be unclamped and continued working on. This is my favorite part of a project. I can finally begin sanding. I could do it all day long. I'd be lying if that was actually true. I'm gonna save you the boring parts of sanding, the worst thing about woodworking. I'm starting at 80 and finishing at 150 grit sandpaper. Finally, I can now begin gluing and nailing the two rails together which starts showing the shape of the stovetop cover. Just because I like doing it, sanding. Just hitting the sides, the edges of the two rails and panel that are recently been glued and nailed together. If you're still here, thank you. And if you feel I've earned your subscription and a like, please hit those buttons. Now, you can see a sneak peek of next month's project. Leave a comment, Walnut, and I'll know you watch my video. 
and I hope to see you in the next one. You're not going to want to miss it. It is an exciting project. I'm just breaking the edges of the panel with 150 grit sandpaper. Then, my part of the project's complete. It's off to my wife. She's gonna paint it, hand paint all the letter, the date, and the crest around the outside of everything. Then, it's off to my neighbor to give to her boss.